instantly. Bam. Come on, mommy. So I gotta wait for this to stop so I can get on. Please, can I get on? Thank you. That's all I really wanted. <laughs> Oh, there's a broken one over there. Can't seem to look behind me. It would make more sense for me to stay on the dock and wait for the kid to get off and just hope he doesn't get off somewhere in the middle of the ride, but... Eh. That's no fun. Suddenly see him running up that trail. <laughs> this is pretty peaceful. <laughs> Near a great forest, there lived a poor woodcutter, his wife and his two children. A boy named Hansel mm. and a girl named Gretel. I know they this story. They were very poor and had very little to bite or sup. <laughs> Sir. What will become of us? The woodcutter asked his wife one night. I tell you what, husband, we will take the children into the thickest part of the forest tomorrow Whoa. and abandon them Who's there. That? No, my wife, I cannot do that, said the man. Then we will all four starve, you fool. Man, she's a bitch. Hansel and Gretel overheard their parents talking, and Gretel began to weep. Do not fret, Gretel, Hansel said. He crept out of the hut and gathered white stones from the ground to fill his pockets. I thought it was breadcrumbs. Right? Maybe I'm remembering it wrong. The next morning, oh, no. the woodcutter leads the children into the forest. Before they leave, their mother gives them a slice of bread. Sure she does. And warns them that they will get no more food that day. That bitch. We need to just kill her and Clever eat her. Hansel leaves a trail of white stones behind them as they pass into the woods. When their father leaves them, the children wait a while, then follow the trail back to their parents' house. Good. Good. <laughs> Smart kids. <laughs> After receiving a thorough scolding from their parents for getting lost in the woods, the children are sent to bed without any supper. Of course. You know, Hansel tried mom's to sneak greedy. out and collect more white stones, but found that the door was locked. Tomorrow I had to get stoned to the woods myself, <laughs> the wife told the woodcutter. In the morning, their mother gave them a slice of bread and led them deep into the forest once again. Who said that? Who's there? Hansel broke his bread into pieces and left a trail of breadcrumbs to lead mm. them safely home. Mm. But hungry-eyed birds snatched up the breadcrumbs and his trail was destroyed. Damn birds. Fuck you, crow. Abandoned by their parents and unable to find the trail home, the children wandered in the forest for three days. Shit got real. <laughs> Kill a squirrel or something. The children stumbled into a clearing with an exceedingly strange house. Its walls were made of gingerbread, and its windows were panes of clear sugar. Oh man. Hansel, desperately hungry, ran forward and began to nibble on the walls. You got high off paint chips. <laughs> my house an old woman emerged from the house sniffing the air That's a witch. and peering around with cloudy eyes oh you dear children who brought you here just come in and stay with me no harm will come to you don't do it but Hansel and Gretel stayed back for the old woman reminded them of their cruel mother now this is Come a witch children, with a W. Don't be afraid. <laughs> I have something for you. 
the old woman offered them two enormous lollipops. The children took them and began to eat. No real food? You see, nothing to fear here. Come yes, yes, my dears. The old woman urged, and the children, still licking their sweets, followed. Hook, line, and sinker. <laughs> oh. Once inside Fuck. The, house, the old woman changed. She stuffed Hansel into a cage. The kennel. Gretel to work, sweeping and cleaning her hut. Your brother will make a good mouthful, the old witch told Gretel. Moskin and bones, Once please don't. Once he's fattened up, I shall feast upon oh, him. Nice. So she's going to actually feed him. Good deal. Time passed, and poor Hansel refused to eat, fearing the day that the witch would eat him. The witch, for her part, grew impatient. Today, I will cook and eat your brother, Gretel. Dun, dun, dun. Climb inside and light the oven. But Gretel pretended not to understand. Uh, I do not know how. Where is the opening? <laughs> Fool, the old witch said. The opening is here. And she moved to show Gretel. Seizing her courage, brave Gretel gave the witch a shove and the old crone tumbled forward into the oven. Nice. Gretel slid a large iron bolt over the door to the oven. Gretel Food's here. Gretel her brother <laughs> and together they lit a fire beneath the oven. And though she screamed and begged, the children sat by the oven until her screams had stilled and the witch was cooked. Oh yeah. Then there's a feast. And then they're going to go back and get and their parents. Then, because even oh, children the mom, can't the dead, survive on sweets. Was it her fault? They divided <laughs> up the body of the old witch and ate her. Yep. A little dark. <laughs> Hopefully this didn't take all uh, all episode. That would suck real bad. Whoa. Stop looking at me, swan. <laughs> What was that like? Six minutes? I don't know. I'm I'm like kind of just recording the whole thing and then I'm gonna just break it up into like sections. You know, trying something new. I figured since it's a short game, you know, and who knows? Maybe I'll just upload it as one large file, one long file. Hmm. <laughs> All right, let's get back on to look for the kid. Callum? Callum? Hansel and Gretel. I used to read it to Callum when the electricity was shut off. Oh. Those poor children. Power turned the off. The whole world against them. It's poor, the then. The forest, the birds, the old witch, even their own parents. Yeah. I used to imagine that Callum and I were the kids in that story. Yeah. Not mother and son, but brother and sister, hand in hand against the unkind world. It's kind of weird that we she would think of her looking for our own house made of candy. son as her brother. For the sweetness that could Maybe she more thinks of herself as a child Hunger leads or a kid or something. Desperate, terrible places where the tree branches reach like claws. <laughs> Sounds like some single mother problems though. <laughs> Oh, the van. Are they really? Are these I'm trails really supposed to, to have like the shuttles this going through place. it? Ooh. Oh damn! Blood everywhere. Oh. Hey, found the teddy bear. <laughs> and despite the constant interruptions at work, Atlantic Island Park. Well, we can... to the bird. that is still lingering in the place I will not make the same mistakes very soon no it's, it's been all for nothing are all these notes left from the guy that bought the park or owns the park 
that, that's got to be the teddy bear we're looking for, right? Or is it like supposed to be like a smaller one, like a shittier one, like one missing an eyeball or something like that, or a button for an eye or some shit? <laughs> oh, what's with oh rocks? Who's up there? Did, did someone throw these at me? Fucking kids! I'll show you. Oh, can't kick them. Can't pick them up. All right. Well, I guess I'll just go on my merry way. <laughs> well, getting closer to the Ferris wheel. Oh, what are the what? Are, what are those things called? Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck. Carousel? No, carousel's the thing with the horses. Or the right? I don't know. Seems like there's a bunch of little. This is the only way to go. There's no, like, you had to go through the ride to get to the next or keep going. That's kind of weird. That's Doesn't seem right at all. The blood run to my head. It make me dizzy. Examine. The guy just snapped. Those poor kids. Right. Two. One, two. Progress. Uh, let's go to that. Bend him away. Lay to my man. Cover him thick away. It's that. It's an animal. It's tiger. And we walked up and face him carving. Yes, one berserk. Uh, one guy got the team of one guy. It's that sad. It's that sad. An ice pick. Two ice cream and drink. And we're dragging him away. And as best we could. And before we're going to eat me. I love one of the poor kids. Landed on my ice sculpture. Damn. That's fucked up. What was it? What was the chipmunk's name? Or was it Chad? Damn, that's fucking crazy. I'm taking someone out with the nice pick? I'm going berserk. <laughs> Obviously, we can't go this way. <laughs> Frustrating, what effect? Machines. Nicholas named them something cute. Yeah, it seems like a lot of stuff is just like left by the person that owns the park. I wonder when it's going to turn from like notes and stuff from the people that own the park to the like all of a sudden. I can't get on while it's moving. <laughs> I'm looking for my son, but yeah. Gotta check out the rides, you know. Stop, Callum! <laughs> oh, polar ride. Oh, I remember this. <laughs> Doesn't look happy at all. <laughs> Callum! Where did you go? Oh, we're gonna ride this ride, that's for sure. Where did you go? 